Hello and welcome to your Phillipsburg News Break. In local business news, this past week the Phillipsburg Mall experienced a power outage, leaving both shoppers in the dark. In sports, Phillipsburg High School's own Jewel Gonzalez took third in the women's junior division in Fargo this week. Said one of her defeated opponents, I haven't seen a girl with that many muscles since my aunt Agnes raided the all-you-can-eat seafood shack in 2003. Thank you, Jewel. You've proved that state liners are more than just cartographers. Now to the weather report with our meteorologist, Mikey Mikes. Mikey? <laughs> Thanks, Mikey. The debate rages on regarding what to call the residents of Phillipsburg. Some are saying Phillipsburgers, while others are saying P-Burgers, which just sounds like it tastes nasty. In legal news, a judge is dismissing the case against a woman, Bet Turthensheets, the woman accused of punching her neighbor in the schnoz in a Wawa for saying that Sheets is better. Quotes the judge, I'm not taking a case where the defendant is so blatantly correct. And in entertainment, this week local parody and comedy artist J. Mikes released his unawaited debut album, One Pork Chop in Each Hand, angering both vegans and all other forms of pig lovers. Critics have this to say. The new J. Mikes album has made me laugh so much that I've cried. Meteorologist Mikey Mikes, you've heard that album. What do you think of it? It's really hot. And that's your Phillipsburg News Brief. I'm your anchor. Good night.